Hello, remember me, Lee Bowery. Would you like to come into my dressing room? The jacket you're looking at is rather interesting in that the gold fringe is made from Kirby grips. I'm an avant-garde designer, and I think things should be larger than life. This is just a small taste of some of the designs you'll be seeing later on, so be prepared. This is my next outfit. You may notice that the rear end is rather exaggerated. I think for too long there's been emphasis on the shoulders. My idea is to reverse everything, turn it upside down, emphasize your backside and perhaps even your hips. That's my tip for 86. Also, take note of the checkerboard. Geometry will be a big number next year. Don't be alarmed, viewers. This isn't a rerun of Star Trek. In fact, it's my living room wallpaper. However, we're still in the realm of imagination, which brings me to my next outfit. This is my pale green angel outfit. Entitled for quite obvious reasons. Perhaps I should mention my makeup. My makeup, my accessories, and even my shoes are an integral part of my total look. One really couldn't exist without the other. They all go to make up a rather bold impression. This outfit's absolutely ideal for making an entrance. The skirt is supported by a crinoline and is rather um, reminiscent of a southern belle. However, the top and the hat are rather angular. In fact, I was once described wearing this outfit as a demented snowflake. These things are rather theatrical, and it won't surprise many of you that some of them have been used on the stage. However, I personally always wear them out to nightclubs, openings of galleries and parties, where I think they um, work very well as well. And finally, my pied de resistance, this gorgeous red tulle ball. This outfit was originally inspired by a tutu, but as you can see, it grew and grew and grew until it was reached massive proportions and turned into a huge puff ball. I quite like the idea of a tutu coming from the bust, like a boob tube tutu. But being the excessive sort of guy I am, I had to put more and more fabric in until it's become a huge tutu ball. This outfit was originally designed for the stage, but I decided to wear it to the opening of a recent nightclub. Nightclubs are a very important part of my life. I always go out there because all my friends do, and the social side of a fashion designer is very, very important. On that note, I think um, I'd better be off. Oops, one more. You may well be wondering what I'm doing here. Believe it or not, one of London's most fashionable nightclubs is just round the corner. And this market is often the route the revellers take on their way home.